Hello and welcome to Evaluate This. I'm Andrew Fryer and in this short screencast I'm going to show you MinShell in Windows Server 2012. MinShell is a way of just having a lightweight user interface just to do the bare minimum of management given that you can do a lot of management tasks now from tools like Server Manager you can see here. And at the moment I've got a virtual machine here called Evaluate This and we can see that it's got the Explorer on here We've got the normal start menu from Windows 8, uh, Internet Explorer's on here, and so on and so forth. But we might not want all of those tools to be on here once we've configured the server. So wouldn't it be good if we could get rid of them? And now in Windows Server 2012, we can. All I need to do is highlight this virtual machine, go to Manage, Remove Roles and Features, select it here, pick the right feature up, user interfaces and infrastructure and what I'm going to do is I'm going to take away the server graphical shell just uncheck it click next this is going to need a restart so I'm going to allow that to happen automatically just hit remove and that's completed if I now go and log on to that machine All I get this time is a command prompt. And if I accidentally close that, the only way I can get anything back is to hit Control Alt Delete and bring up Task Manager. And I go to More Details. You can see the new Task Manager here in Server 2012. And I can go to File and Run a new task. For example, Server Manager. And that's pretty much all I need to be able to do on here because from the tools options here there's a whole load of other things I can do as well like look at events, task scheduler, memory diagnosis and of course run PowerShell directly on this machine. As well as being able to remove the graphical shell in Windows Server 2012 we can also decide when management tools get installed. If I go and add a feature in here onto this virtual machine for example DHCP server, notice that I have the option to include management tools if I want to, and I don't have to. I might do my DHCP management for example using the new IP address management feature, so I don't need this tool all over my servers. And it's one less thing to worry about, one less thing to patch. And that's the whole point of InShell really, it's about taking away stuff we don't need on every server, reducing patching, reducing the attack surface. And of course we can put things back as well if we want to. And that contrasts with what we had in Windows Server 2008 and 2008 R2 with the Server Core install, which is an install only option. And if you want to try all this for yourselves, you can download the Windows Server 2012 Evaluation Edition, good for 180 days, from the link below. I've been Andrew Fryer. Thank you very much for listening.